community health centers have a long history and they started here in the Boston area and they provide a health home and safety net for patients that would under, otherwise be unable to get care. Patients who, you know, the underserved, oftentimes they're low income, they're elderly, they are from the LGBT community, which here at Fimway, our mission is to serve the LGBT community and surrounding neighborhood, creating a space where everyone feels welcome. So for a lot of my patients that I see here at the community health center, they haven't received regular care, medical, or dental in quite a while. Here at the health centers, we serve a range of different people. Um, within the community, we have large immigrant populations, we have populations that have had very limited access to dental care, and in some cases, no dental care in their lifetime. It's absolutely critical that these health centers provide the care to these patients. And we see the entire family. Um, you know, I have patients, it's the mother, the father, the children, the grandparents, we see generations. We're trying to really cut down on emergency-based dentistry and really make oral health and preventative dentistry and routine dental care a part of these patients' lives. A healthy mouth is a gateway to a healthy body and vice versa. If tooth decay is left untreated, that can lead to serious infections, which it can be fatal if not taken care of appropriately. If you're having tooth pain and you're having to go to work or go to school, you can't focus on your job or your family and live a happy and healthy life. If these patients did not have access to care, the, these high-risk patients that we see here at the health centers, it would impact their overall quality of life. I've seen it firsthand. I see patients that have pain, that have multiple teeth that need to be extracted, patients who are missing teeth in critical areas that if they go for a job, if they are looking for an interview, the first thing the employer will notice is, you know, a front tooth is missing. And so here at the health center, we can really give them that start and hopefully help them so they succeed, you know, in their life, but also in their overall health. There's a lot of systemic conditions, such as HIV, diabetes, pregnancy, Alzheimer's, that show oral health signs. And so if I notice these signs of systemic conditions, I can refer patients down to medical. It's in our same building here, and that's what's great about community health centers, is that we're able to offer these range of services all in one place, essentially one stop for patients to get basic preventive healthcare services. And it's a, it's a health home for them. The focus here is how can we make the patient healthy? And they're the number one concern. 